We've all had an uncomfortable, upset stomach that we hope will pass. But what if there's more to it? Well, here to share the science of SIBO is our gut health guide, board certified gastroenterologist at Cedar sinai Medical Center, Dr. Mark Pimentel. Welcome to the show, Dr. Pimentel. Thanks, it's great to be with you today. What changes can our viewers make to their diets now, today, to ward off these SIBO symptoms? And we sort of call it low fermentation diet or low fermentation eating. You want to eat foods that humans digest. I mean, so things like fiber, things like legumes, things like non-absorbed sugars, which are the composition of many sweeteners that you use in your coffee, and, and even now in a lot of sodas they use these, they have zero calories for you, but they're sugar for bacteria, and the bacteria ferment it a lot. And that's when you get all these tremendous symptoms. So you have to be careful with your diet.